Hello everyone, and welcome. I believe this is part 8 of my playthrough. And I believe I was going to do a little bit of backtracking. Picked up a key for the scorpion doors, I do believe. Ah, there's one right here. Just tell me this is not a one-time use, like the uh, lockpick. Good. I wouldn't want to put my hand on that door like that. I'm getting impaled by those scorpions. Okay. I keep expecting to find the key to that. But I'm not finding anything. However, there are... Scorpion doors upstairs. Unfortunately, if I go upstairs, I may have to deal with the psychopath again. Yeah, I don't have that key, so we have to go this way. Just, just shut up. I am not made of ammo, son. Get out of here. Oh shit. Go away. Oh, not again. That's not very nice. Shut the wall. I'm all screwed. Okay, good. He's gonna fall over now. I'm pretty certain there was a door up here that I could use the scorpion key on. Watch, I was totally mistaken and there isn't. And I... came up here for nothing. Oh, here we go. Can't close that for some reason. But I can open this. Come on, quickly. Okay. Normally I would take the time to read the lore, but it takes extra time and I don't like reading it out loud. But dentures? Someone's dentures? What did that say? Um, hide the dog? Okay. Wait a minute, the dog heads. Living room grandfather clock I have, the book in the recreation room I have, the dissection room in the basement. I've been in the basement. I didn't find animal heads. I'm going through health way too fast right now, too. Oh, nice handgun ammo. Right, do I have enough inventory space? Yes, I do. Aw, oh, it's broken. Oh, I can swap the broken shotgun out for the good shotgun. Got it. Now that is going to let me traverse the basement. I already looked at that. All right. Can I get past that guy without getting attacked again? So. Why are there dentures in here? Pretty messed up dentures. Very dirty. We need to soak those. Okay, I don't think there's anything else I need to do upstairs. Isn't this the last place I knocked him down? Where'd he go? Wish I could put that helmet on though. Maybe keep myself a little safer. I feel a little bit safer, at least with this shotgun. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Was that Ethan making that noise? Okay. Well, we'll get rid of the psycho, psychoactive or whatever powder tablets, whatever it is. Oh, 
that's that's nothing. That's just a picture. I think I just need to free up one inventory slot to be able to hold both shotguns at the same time. Oh yeah, boxes this way. Kind of right in front of my face, you know? Okay. Go on, keep running. Keep moving, Ethan. Ah! Oh, that's a uh, psycho. You know what? Safe room. Can he not come in here? You're part of the family now. All right, can I sneak away from him? I could really use the shotgun. Well, this seems to be working Where for the moment. Does he really expect me to answer? That door is so loud. Well, I would not have run into him at all if I actually had inventory space and the shotgun out. Okay. Let's hope we can sneak our way back downstairs before he pops out of there. I don't know if I actually need to be quiet right now. I'm just doing it just in case. Okay. I have yet to encounter him in this area. So I'm going to hope that it's safe for me to stand up here. Oh, we need to load this thing. You know, the faster way is to open the action, toss the shell, toss a shell in there, and then put three in the two. Yeah, we're getting these out, aren't we? Anyway, I think it would be a good idea to save right now. I hope that I'm not going to get attacked right away. Yeah, it looks like we're good. So the third head is in one of these rooms. What room did it say? Did it say dissection room? This does not look like a dissection room. Again, none of these rooms look like dissection rooms to me. At some point, at this point, and we'll do what we did last time and hope it works. Crap. I'm not hitting it, and I'm out of ammo. I actually survived that? I mean, I wasted all my ammo, so what point is there in surviving? Well, so much for that attempt. Oh, it saved on the way down. Nice. Guess I could have just let it auto save and not waste a save on the, uh, the tape recorder thing. Yeah, I really need to remember that these things can rush forward like that. And I need to pop them in the head to stagger them so I can't do that. Alright, 
One down. Two down. Good. Yeah, these two go down fairly easily if you connect your headshots, but that, that one in here does not like to go down. That's not dead. Oh, you've got to be kidding. Holy cow. One's in here really tough. I only have two shots left. I don't even have the key that opens this door. Come on, load. Slow loading. Oh, we survived. We have no ammo left, but we survived. All right, so is there a point to coming in here? What did we just make? Yeah, that's what I thought. We need a key. Oh, I think I just wasted my ammo for nothing. That is extremely unfortunate. At least they could have done this had extra ammo in here. You know? another one of these. Um, I was desperate enough for ammo and not hurting too badly on health supplies. Although honestly I don't understand what the the need for um, large health would be. Yeah, this kind of looks like a dissection room. It actually looks more like an incineration room, but that's okay. So theoretically, somewhere in here, there's a... Uh, I would just assume it's in here. From the handprint. I don't seem to be able to do anything with it. So it's probably in here, but this is locked. So how does one unlock it? Hmm. Well, should I take the psychoactive stuff? Well, there's definitely something in there. Oh, what do we have here? Strong chem fluid. What did I just make 10 of? Enhanced handgun ammo does more damage. Okay. What do I load it into my oak oh, page down? Okay. Very interesting. 
Okay, there is something in here. Something right here. The antique coin. Something here. An herb. I have to admit this stuff is useful. How long does it last? Is it over already? No, apparently not. It's all this stuff behind this door. No. Oh, it's a bobblehead. Hopefully the stuff lasts long enough, you know? I didn't realize there was so much little stuff that I was missing. Very useful stuff. All right, it's either worn off or it only works in the area you took it. I wish there was some visible indication of whether or not it was still working. other than just seeing those floating icons. Locked from the other side. How do we get in? What made that noise? Nice handgun ammo. So if I look around a little bit more, I might find a few things that I missed. Because it's obvious I'm missing stuff after taking those pills. It's one of those games that does reward you for exploring, I guess. Of all the Resident Evil games that I've played, they seem to reward you for that. But I found very little in here. So the odds are there probably is more stuff. And I just have to look around more. I wish I had a lot more of those pills. But I also want to go back to that room with the fireplace and see what I can find. Supposedly, there's something hidden in that fireplace. Maybe it's the key for this. I'm kind of disappointed I haven't found the key yet. I feel like that door is the next place I need to go. And I'm just not finding any way through it. All right, I really don't think there's anything left. I don't know, there could always be something like along a wall or something or in a corner that I haven't seen. Shoot, there could be something here I haven't seen. All right, I'm going to go back. See if I can make it to that room with the fireplace. And see if I notice anything that I missed along the way. Well, honestly, if I'm just fast about it, that psychoactive stuff will 
probably still be working when I come back. 